Taranto to take the set piece. A lot of tall options. Into danger, go to the far post, Taranto. And just over the crossbar, but a really dangerous strike from Adriana Taranto. Papadopoulos in support. Papadopoulos still going. Scott Johnson there as well. Uses it. Johnson taking on Massos and got into a dangerous area and Keane couldn't get ahead on it. And neither Vlanic on the far post as well. Played into a dangerous area and it's come off the head of Hannah Keane. And she gets her 12th goal of the season. And a great way to start for, the West, for Western United. Yeah, and as I touched on, the threat that this side is aerially on and on all set pieces. Vlanic, using her speed, going outside, cuts it across, and Hanakin unable to control it, but a dangerous cross. But it's fallen to Angie Beard, who's taken a strike, and Sham Carps knocks it over the crossbar. Almost getting a goal out of nothing. The, the key for Wanderers, as I've touched on, is them being able to play the ball forward and, and connect passes. And Hannah Keane's done really well to beat Ferris there. And Hannah Keane gets her 13th goal of the season and doubles the lead for Western United. And a great afternoon for her. And now she's the outright leader in the Golden Boot race. And these girls are absolutely loving it. And Western United, they almost completed what they need to do. Potentially Steer might come on for the likes of Carly Johnson as a straight swap. I think so. Uh, fresh legs provide a bit of extra energy out there. Ball's found its way out wide to Sophie Harding. Who's found Caceres in space and it's fallen to Saveska. Taking a long range effort, and it's gone into goal. Looked like Hillary Beal slipped. And Sienna Saveska coming on and making an impact. And what a tremendous mo moment for Sienna Saveska. Uh, since she's entered the game and each time we've seen her come on in previous matches, great energy. She's technically excellent. She finds herself uh, in a position where she's able to change feet. So from right to left, and we know that she has a lethal left foot.